whoever put this in the qualifying exam is an evil, sadistic person. Okay. I, I cannot believe this was put in a qualifying exam. Um, yeah. I, God. It was horrible. I don't know what, what you were trying to do. You're trying to put, give us a trig reduction formula integral or, or combinatorial integral or what? What do you, like, come on. Get that combinatorial stuff out of here. Okay, no one likes combinatorics. No one, no one does. Okay, so here, um, if you're a beginner like me, the best thing to do is you're just gonna have to spam queens to to disrespect the problem writers to solve this. Pretty much is is to use to spam queens rule, right? Okay, so let u equal pi minus x. You'll get like negative pi, pi. The cosine is being it's an even exponent, so don't you worry. Right, we're still gonna get cosine 2020x dx, right? And this is still, you know, by symmetry, we get this, right? Yes. And then we do Queen's rule again, let u equal pi over 2 minus x, right? We get negative pi over 2, pi over 2, and then this will be like sine 2020x dx. But I mean it's still it's still technically the same thing, right? Do symmetry. Right, and then do Queen's rule again, and you still get cosine 2020x. Like nothing changes, nothing changes, right? I mean, honestly, we don't even have to put it back to sine, uh, cosine. You can just leave it as sine. You literally leave it as sine, right? And the reason is because they're going to equal the same thing when we apply Wally's trick, right? So this is just going to equal to like four pi over 2 times, and then um, because it's an even even exponent, it's pi over 2 times 1, 2, 3, 4, uh, 6, 5, 6, 7, 8, and then it keeps going all the way until we reach like 2019, 2020. Okay, so yeah, very disrespectful, unfortunately. Um, let me simplify this portion though. So this is equal to 2 pi, right? And I'm going to kind of introduce you guys that this is 2019 double factorial over 2020 double factorial. If they if the judge does not accept this answer, they should not be working in the integration B organization. I'm I'm sorry, but you should not be like this this should be an acceptable answer. Because let me be real with you, I can care less about putting this in combinatorials. I know nothing about combinatorics. I don't like combinatorics. No one likes combinatorics. This, I'm just putting it like this. So for those who don't know, uh, a double factorial is, um, I would say skipping by two, but technically is skipping by two. So like whenever you have n minus, like, um, I guess I'll, I'll do it like n, n factorial. I'll do n double factorial, and this is equal to like n, n minus 2, n minus 4, so it's always subtracting by 2, right, until you get to whichever, until you get to like 1 or 2 in this case, because I'm, you know, I must assume n is even, <laughs> okay, uh, I think it's better if I go like this, I think it's better if I write it like, like this, right, if, if this was 2n factorial, right, then it would be like 2n, uh, 2n minus 2, 2n minus 4, and then it comes until 2, right? 2, 0, and that's it. It stops at here. So technically it stops at 2. You know, if we had like an odd, an odd integer, odd with a double factorial, then you get 2n plus 1, then subtract 2 again, 2n minus 1, 2n minus 3, until you reach to like 1. Three times one, and then you're done. So that's that's double factorial, right? And that's what we have, that's what we have here, right? It's just subtracting by two or adding by two, whatever. So this is our answer technically. Um, do we have to put in combinatorials? I say no. That's really unnecessary. That's that would be very dishonoring of MIT if they force you to do to use combinatorials. That would be that would be disgusting. Uh, but here, this should be this should be acceptable, okay? 
No way in hell I'm simplifying it in terms of factorials. No way in hell. Like, I don't have time for that. Okay? No one has time for that. Okay? 2 pi times 2019 fa uh, double factorial over 2020 double factorial. Okay? Their answer sheet... Yeah. Like, like who has time for this? No one has time for that. Okay? <laughs> so, this is my answer. And, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching.